<gasps> oh, welcome back. Welcome back to Sally Face. Now, um, I just recently got the, the season pass, so we're going to see episode two. We finished episode one, so we're going to go to episode two. Um, well, many of you guys like this and like Sally Face, and you guys seem to like it. So I went ahead and got, the, got another season of it. Well, anyways, I hope you guys will enjoy this one. Sit back, relax, and enjoy. Sal? Sally, where are you? <gasps> oh my god. We're a boy. Oh my god, I'm just a boy. Alright, I'm gonna go. <gasps> birds. Oh my god. Stupid birds. So apparently we're a kid in this. <gasps> There's our mum. Don't, don't wander so far, sweetie. I want to see the doggy, mom. Can you hear him? Why don't you wait until your father gets here, okay? You should be here any minute now. But I really want to see it. Please? Please, can I go pet the doggy? Oh, alright, Sal. Just give me a second to get my purse. Then we can go together. Yay! I, I, I'll wait over there by the trees. Alright, up. Oh. All right, mom. We're gonna. I'm, I'll wait for you. Better come. Oh god, I just wanna pet the doggy. Where's the doggy at? Oh no. Oh jeez, there's a lot of. I thought. Oh, oh god. Is, is that the big bad wolf? Oh, I think that's the big bad wolf. Wow, this is very far from the trees. Oh god, why are we so bloody? Oh, something probably slashed our face. That's why we wear the mask. My theory. Oh my god, this is a terrible idea. How did I even get up here, end up here? Oh my god, there's dogs, there's a skull. Uh, ooh, ice cream truck. No, it's an ambulance. What the? Oh my god, where am I? Thank you so much for coming out, for coming to help out with the toilet. No problem, Miss Miss Sanderson. I'll I'll have it unclogged in no time. Wonderful. Herman normally would have taken care of it himself, but unfortunately his fingers have turned into banana peels. And the street corner is just so dangerous. I understand. Thank you so much, Larry. The bathroom is just over there. My name is not Larry. My name is not Larry. How dare you say that to me? Where's where's the toilet? There is no toilet. I've been lied to. Oh Jesus Christ! I want to take a. Oh, that's disgusting. Oh. Oh. Damn, lady, you need to get your freaking toilet changed. Look where I'm at now. Oh hi, hi pony. You there? Please help me. What's wrong? The water. It stopped. Don't worry, I'll fix it. Uh, I know how to fix this. Please, hurry. Uh, 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 uh. Sounds like he really needs... He's thirsty. Switch. Oh my god. Uh, the switch doesn't even work. That's it. I'm going over here. Uh, never mind. I'm going over here. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Oh my god. What's up here? Another switch. Ah! Oh, this one worked. So let's go downstairs. And I think I shall put this switch on. That one does not work yet. Perfect. Oh my god, we did it. It worked! Alright, since it worked, now we can go check on the pony. Oh my god. Alright, pony, I'm going to check up on you. Um, you better not... Oh, oh, look at the water. Are you ha- It killed him. 
Damn, he got fat. Holy shit. Not that they're up. Oh, they're back. Hello? <laughs> Killer. Oh, that's what happened here. Oh my god. Alright, I'm leaving. Goodbye. Oh no, who's the murderer? Oh no. Oh no, it's in our footsteps. Oh god. Hello? I'm just walking about in the darkness. Nothing, nothing much. Oh my god, Charlie. Sal, come closer. I have something to show you. Oh no. Oh no, is this pony collection? I know you touched my pony. <laughs> I know we're friends now. Oh. I should have never touched this pony. Ooh, it's snowing. I love the snow. Ooh, episode two, the wretched. Wow. Oh my God, there's Larry. Man, you've been having those nightmares. I haven't had them since them this bad since right after my mom died. I really think this it's the it's this building. There's something off about it. Dude, I think you're so insistent about it, but really I don't think it's this place it's haunted. I've been here for most of my life and haven't seen any ghost. But but what, Larry? But what? Well, we've known each other for a while now. I have to show you something. Oh god, is it your pony collection? Come on. <laughs> Jeez, come on, let's go. Let's go. Oh, it's snowy. The fav my favorite time of the year. Come on. Oh, I love the snow. Look how beautiful this is. This is like so amazing. Whoa! How come you never told me about this? It's where I go when I need to be alone. It's my fortress of solitude. Wow. Now isn't that neat? Awesome! Ooh, I love this. Oh my god. Oh my god, I love tree houses. I've never been in a tree house. If you guys have been in a tree house, let me know. Please. Alright, this is so cool. I've always wanted a tree house when I was younger. Yeah, my dad built it for me before he disappeared. Wait, what? What do you mean, disappeared? One day he was here and everything was okay. And the next day he was just gone. No, 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 nothing. All of these things were still here. His clothes, his tools, his wallet, his driver's license, everything he disappeared. Damn, I'm so sorry, Larry. I know how hard it is. Hard that is. Did your parents not get along? No, my parents loved each other. They hardly even fought or anything. It isn't what it sounds like. My dad didn't leave us. Even if that's what my mom chooses to believe. I know he wouldn't ever leave us like that. He loved us. I believe you. So what do you think that happened? Look, look, you know, I'm not generally superstitious. And I know you and your chug swear that the apartments are haunted. But, well, I think it's something else. Like what? I haven't told my parent people many people about this, but I know I can trust you, Sal. I know you won't judge me. Of course not. The day before he disappeared, I did something I'm not too proud of. My parents got some firecrackers and he told me <clears throat> so many times to wait for them, not to play with them on my own, but I couldn't resist, dude. A bit. A lo a lit a few and back and ended up in Mrs. Gibson's open window and it killed her pet rabbit. Oh man, that's rough. Yeah, so I I ran to check on Miss Gibson and her was screaming at me like crazy, as if I needed another reason to piss off. That old bag. I felt horrible though. That poor bunny. Anyways, I was coming down in the elevator. That's when I saw the demon. Da -da 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 -da. He reached down and touched me. I got super cold, chilled down my whole body. I was scared shitless, dude. I thought I was losing my mind. He was gone as quick as he came. 
just as the doors opened. He, he cursed me because of what I did. I cursed me. Everything in my life was fucked after that. My dad disappeared. My mom stopped talking for a while. I had to spend two weeks in juvie for accidentally killing that rabbit. My bike got stolen. I missed so much of school. I had to take summer classes. It's been one bad thing after the next. Ever since then, horrible have things have happened to me or around me. So you think it's curse that took your dad away? I know how it sounds, but I think it's all my fault. My dad, the rabbit, the Sanderson's, everything. Whoa, hold on, man. Even if there is some kind of curse on you, you can't believe, blame yourself for every bad thing that happens. It's not all your fault. Da -da -da. What did this demon look like? It was like nothing I've ever seen before. It was like a moving shadow, all black and misty, but had the form of a man. And the eyes were worst part. The deep red eyes that pierced right through you. Holy shit, what? I've seen it too. I've seen your demon. No way, what? I swear I've seen it in the building, just like when you described. I bet it's linked to another ghost, to other ghosts too. I don't know, dude. What if we break this curse of yours? How could we do that? Uh, may maybe there's some kind of clues around that could help. We could try to find out more about the ghost, see if we can get to the bottom of this. Sure, why not? I got nothing else to lose. Oh, okay. All right, so it looks like Larry told us about his past. Uh, my mom, my mom didn't try any to buy everything when he comes back, okay. Ooh, nothing useful in here. Oh, this is dead and huh, that's strange. What is that? I found this weird Gear Boy cartridge in the Lost and Found a while ago. Dig it reacts to supernatural activity. Huh, was that one of the last pictures we took together before he disappeared? Hmm, better keep looking. Oh my god, ooh. Ooh. Take. Apparently our Game Boy, oh, what's in the box? I have no idea, it belongs to my dad. It's some kind of weird puzzle box. Never figured out how to open it though. Looks like there's a piece missing. Yeah, you're right, I never noticed that before. Do you mind if I hold on to this? Nah, go ahead. Cool. Oh, oh my god. Just let me know if you get open. Of course. Wow. Alright, well... Man, that really sucks what happened to his dad. Alright, come on, Larry. It's time to go, Larry. It's been fun, but I think it's time to go. Okay, Larry. It's pretty cold out here. I know. We're all buttoned up and stuff, but it's time to go. Oh jeez. I'm gonna look around and see what else I can find out. Okay, sounds good. I sort of have to stay here and take care of my mom while she's super sick. Yeah, I noticed that. Well, let me know if there's anything you need. Thanks, Sally. Ooh, nice painting. Alright, well, I'm leaving. I should ask Megan if she knows anything about the DNA. Maybe she'll come out today. Ooh, is this the mom's room? Ooh, damn. Hey Lisa, feeling any better today? Oh, hiya Sal. I think today might be the worst of, of it all. Once I'm over this, huh, I'll be the one right as rain. Which is be good because there's so much work to be done. I'm just itching to get back to it. Take care, take it easy for now and get some rest. Oh, don't you worry about me Sal. I've been resting plenty and Larry has been helpful too. I'll be just fine. Okay, well, get better. Ooh, maybe there's something in the bathroom. I'm going to this damn bathroom. Hey, toilet, you wanna talk that shit? Okay. Anything in the kitchen? Yeah, I'd assume not. All right, well, we're gonna go back upstairs. Mm. Oh, damn. Chunk. What are you up to? Hi, hi Sally. 
I'm just waiting for a snack guy to fill the machine. Can't wait my Saturday without chocolate. I hear ya. I'd like to start the weekend off with some video games and cartoons. Did you see the new Rickos Madison's Wife episode? Yeah, that was great. I love that show. Me too. Oh my god. Boy, okay. We have so much in common. Okay, does it look like there's anything useful right now? Alright, well, got it. I think we'll go upstairs now. Oh no, wrong place. Bad. Ooh, they bricked up that that thing right there. They don't want anyone going in that. Oh my god. Gizmo, what are you doing, Gizmo? What you watching, buddy? Facts. He's spitting facts. Best facts I've ever heard. Oh, I to, oh not in the bathroom. Oh, gee, that's disgusting. God damn it, Gizmo. Ooh, look at my room. It's all better now. Ooh, my guitar. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Well, it's time to go in here now. Dad? <gasps> He's working. Hey, Dad. Can't talk right now, Sal. I'll have, I'll have this deadline for work. Alright, Dad. Whatever you say, man. I'm gonna go and go outside and and do things. I don't think anyone's here. Oh shit, no one's there. Whoa. Oh, hi, Sal. What Yin's up to do today? Hey, David. Have you seen any ghosts around? Yeah, for sure. The ghosts of my past keep me awake. Night, Alice, uh, time. I barely have any s sleep around here. Oh. Uh, what about, like, a spirit of someone else that used to live here? Sally Yeans, I gotta lay off the drugs, man. Trust me, you'll have a better life for it. Don't make the some mistakes I did. Not going to. What happened to your pants? Ugh. Oh, well, they're just wash. Still, Sarah was supposed to go get it. Oh, I can't read this. Okay. Jesus Christ. I'd never end up like that, kids. They're pretty busy right now. Oh my god, Anderson. Good evening, Sally. It's been so nice to see you. I I hope you're doing well today. Hi, Mr. Anderson. I'm good. How are you? Wonderful. Thank you for asking. So how, how may I be of service to you? What's with the new cameras? Didn't you and your father receive the invitation to the most monthly meeting? Ha! <laughs> Everything is getting discussed there. Um, oh yeah, I guess that we kind of forgot about it. That's a problem at- that's not a problem at all. I do suggest you join in on the meetings in the future if you're able to do that is. You see, it helps keep everyone informed and up to date anyhow. To answer your question, I've had a new security system put in. For everyone's safety, and with all the recent events, the triggers are getting nervous and up with the new. State of the art security system is for everyone to feel more comfortable with their living arrangements. That makes sense. Thanks for catching me up on that. My pleasure. See any ghost around. Oh heavens, to the bestie, please don't tell me this building is haunted. The last thing I need right now is some permomosis phantoms frightening my tent ants. I'm having a hard enough keeping everyone happy while Lisa is sick. No, no, it's okay, Mr. Anderson. Everything is okay. I was just, um, uh, I'm working on the paper for school. Yeah, that's all. Phew, nearly had a heart attack. I'm simply cannot handle any more stressors at the moment. You are doing great. Try not to hurt yourself. Thank you, Han. So, goodbye. Good day. Man, that guy sure cares about the residents of, of this fine establishment. Who is it? It's Sal from upstairs. Is there something you want? I just wanted to talk to you. Uh, to me? Oh, alright. Come on in. The door is open. Whoa. Oh, it's an old lady. Hello there, Sally. What brings you a young girl like yourself to this old woman? 
Hi, Miss Rosalie. I want to ask you a few things, if you, if that's okay. Oh, ask away, child. I may not have much left, but time is all I got now. Yes, time's all I have, and and even they'll slip away from me. Or maybe I've never ha had this grasp on it at all. Such a strange concept, isn't it? Time sitting here alone, mind could drift. A great deal of wondering what's beyond the veil. Get too deep into these thoughts and the world may makes less and less sense. Yes, even an engine my Oh, listen to me rambling. <laughs> I'm so sorry, dear. Sally, had something to ask? How long have you been here? Oh, long indeed, though it's hard to say exactly. My old mind can barely hold on to any memories of yesterday anymore. Let alone the distant past. I'm afraid days are nearing an end soon, so I will return to dust and my con consciousness will merge with the great mysterious nothing a void is impossible for me the little brains for I've tried, yes, that, that powerful dread, the emptiness, nothingness. Oh, I'm sorry, sweetie. Have Yes, you have. <laughs> What's your question? It's okay, I was just asking how long you lived in Anderson Apartments. You know, I remember Anderson when he moved here from the overseas from a concert from this building. Actually, this land belonged to my family first, but I decided to sell the Anderson since I was the only one remaining. I thought the company would have a nice to have again someone to share the anguish of life with. I was a young and desperate, desperate for a new beginning. What a foolish girl I was. Have you regret selling the land? A life as old as mine is filled with regrets, my dear. Though it will eventually become meaningless. That's true. Have you ever seen any ghost here? Ghost? Why in heavens would you worry about such thing as ghost Sally? You're such a sweet young girl. We're not a ghost. You all remind me of myself from another time. Do old Rose a favor. Enjoy your life while it last. And concern all of Many, I know. Yes, yes. Tempting. Very easy to get pulled in. Why you could say all... We are all ghosts, really. Just waiting to pass from this place to the next. Such a thin membrane from existence, from exit. With our frail bones and delicate cashings, a small misstep would send us really into a tornado of blink of die. It sounds like she really. She's earing her end ends there. Hey, right, everybody. The video's getting quite long here. Just want to make it you know, a reasonable time for you guys to watch. But if you guys want the videos to be longer, I'll actually, I'll do longer so that way it won't be in episodes, but probably, you know, just so I know, just let me know. And um, yeah, this has been Sally Face episode two. Things are getting pretty interesting with Larry's dad. And so far we're meeting new people in the story. Anyways, um, has been fancy seeing you guys here. Make sure you, give this video a like and also i'll do you another thing give this video a subscribe anyways thank you all for watching i very much appreciate your company and watching me on this journey of sally face anyways i will see you all and the next one bye